hello guys welcome to another video so this is a registration and a login page i've created and as you can see nicely placed here so you click on here you have your sign up form here as well you click back login you have your login you enter your email here then you have the password field enter your password you can show your password here as well you can hide it as well then we have the forgot password area as well you type your email account then your new password here as well as you can see everything is working confirm password as well then you update your password as well yeah you click back everything is working the sign up button here as well you have your new password as well here yeah. the email confirm sign up button as well so let's take a look at this code as well so in the code section the, the code is a little bit many so this is about 307 lines but the code is not actually that mean so i don't want to get scared when you see that code so the reason is let's say for example this comment alone has to take about one two three four five six seven so this nicely comment i have to made here to separate this code here took alone took about eight to seven lines and there is about four of three four or three of these inside so imagine the comment section alone is taking about 21 to 30 lines so it, it means the code is not that many so don't get bored of it so this i have to make this comment just to separate the code nicely for you to understand it so this is login page so it means anything that comes under this is our login page we have our login page here Anything that comes out is a login page. Then we have the forgot password page. So as you can see, this also wrapped in this nice comment tag here. Then you go. So all these are forgot password. And then we come to another section. So this is registration page. So it means every code under this is a registration page. So if you see email here, yeah, email entry, email entry email label so it means if you see an email entry on the registration page email label this is it right here this is the registration page all the way down so don't get confused about the code so the next thing we are going to do is i'm going to make a video where i will link this to a database so at the time of recording this, I have not done the database yet, but I'm sure if I upload this to YouTube, I would have connected to database for you guys as well. So I put the link in the description when I'm done. I upload both videos, so you can check the description as well for the link to how to connect this to a database as well. And the source code is going to be available in the description as well. If you look at the top here as well, I've placed, I've written this in the comment tag as well. So here is, I say type pip install below in your terminal to install image ticket in the module. So for you to be able to use this project, this file here, you may, you may need this module, the pillow module, which allows us to use pictures. So what the pillow does is, it's a module that allows us to use pictures need so from pillow import image taken image so if in your terminal you can go to your terminal here I think I'm using PyCharm so here is my terminal so all I have to do is just type pip install pillow pip install pillow then hit on enter you need internet connection so as you can see requirements already satisfied so it means i already have below 
installed in my system already so the same requirements already satisfied so if you don't have it you just have to install it i'm not sure it's it's big as it's not even o over five megabytes i think so you don't even need a lot of data to even install it and if you are using visual studio code you just have to go to the terminal there as well click type the same thing pip install pillow if it's by uh, if it's command prompt same thing pip install pillow to install the module for this then you import it inside yeah so you import your ticket from ticket import as there is from pillow import image ticket image then you are done then everything will be working perfectly here yeah? working perfectly here yeah, as well